Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I am Noxious One, that is a box. Now as you can see, this is a box from Console Vault. I'm gonna open it up, take a look at what's inside. And there we are, looking at the prize that was in the box. This is a Console Vault. This is going in my Ram 1500. This goes in the space underneath the center console. There's another storage space in there and this gives you a nice place to lock up your guns or any other valuables you may have in there. So let's take a look inside and get this thing installed. All right guys, so here we are in the truck. The console bolt will go in here. Well, not in here, it will go underneath this. I don't need my mask because I'm alone here. There is the regular console that has everything in it and this is where the console vault console vault goes. So as you can see we got some decent space in there and this is a safe that I normally have in there. So the console vault will be replacing this. All right, again, there's our console vault. I'm gonna set this down, adjust the camera angle so I can do an in-depth installation of this. So let's get our camera angle down here. Hopefully you can see into it. It is going into this space here. Now this is, this is the tricky part so make sure you guys, I don't know, you may have to slow this down, but you definitely want to pay attention to this installation. Oh, I, I guess it wasn't that bad. That was, that was way easier than I thought it was going to be. So they've already got it set to four zeros you have a four combination lock here so you have 10,000 combinations possible on this one and other than that there are my destructions I have four self tapping screws there and there are pre-drilled holes so Take it out, put it in your factory console. You have pre-drilled holes on both sides. Get them started. And they are threaded. They do have a threaded boss on them. I'm gonna go get my socket wrench and finish up the installation on this. All right, I have a socket wrench and a screwdriver with the socket head on it. It is a 7 16 I'm gonna start with this because this makes it nice and easy. Like I said, They've got them. They got those bosses on there that are set up. So they are threaded. And then you just screw into your plastic that's in there. So I'll get this one put in here. Bring it down so you can get a look in that and as you can see two of them are threaded in there and I did the one over in this corner I'm going to go to the opposite side and do the back one
This is tough to do holding the camera and at a bad angle. But if you weren't trying to film yourself doing this, this is like a five minute installation. I mean, and that's including unpacking it and putting it away or dropping it in there. And that is it. The four screws are in. It is completely locked in there. It just turns and you spin your locks and you are completely locked down. It sets down, doesn't interfere with the top console at all. You do lose a little bit of space because of the steel in there and then this is covering up there was a little ledge back here not that big a deal because you gain an absolutely safe and secure place to keep your firearm while you're in your truck literally there are your installation instructions and like i showed you it's super easy take it out of the box take everything out of your console because otherwise it's not going to fit drop it into your console and you are good to go put in those four screws locks it in it's not coming out of there you've got a nice dial lock on it they sent me the one with the four four dials on it so i have a 10,000 combination lock on there and there are your instructions for setting the combination the factory on this one comes set to four zeros if you get the three lock combination it's going to come set to three zeros you turn it to open it up because that's the only way you can reset your lock there's your little reset button there you push that in roll your dials to whatever you want for your combination release it and then your new combination is set so there you have it there is the console vault installed in a 2016 ram 1500 super easy install and it's completely locked in and it makes me feel a lot better about having a gun out here in the truck because they can't just walk away with that one if they did get in here and find it so this will keep my gun completely secure in this truck never have to worry about it so go check them out at consolevault.com they've got a ton of them i don't know if they have your specific vehicle because i don't know what your specific vehicle is they do make one for a harley davidson bagger which they also sent me and probably not next week but the week after we're going to see if that installation is just as easy as this one so like share and subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one